it's yoga time aloha make sure you have blocks with you and everything you need to support yourself in your practice and i'm so glad you made it onto your mat if you love this channel please don't forget to subscribe and to let people know about it sending you love i'll see you soon on your mat aloha aloha everyone thank you so much for making it onto your mat We'll start with some breathing exercises. So come onto your heels, knees together, hands gently laying onto your thighs, and we'll close our eyes here. Just closing your eyes, allowing yourself to sink deeper into your heels, drawing the tailbone down, drawing the belly button up into the spine, and bringing the shoulders above the hips and start rolling your shoulders back and down here. Close your eyes, allowing your face to relax, allowing your eyebrows, your cheeks, your jaw to just melt down and relax here. We'll notice how we feel in all of our body, and in our bellies and our chest and what we're bringing onto our mats right now, the energy we want to create for ourselves, how we feel currently and what we can let go of. Switch directions with your circles here. And we'll start tapping into our breaths here. Take a deep breath into the belly and let it out again and release good gently open your hot eyes and send your hips into your heels arms forward into a child's pose take a deep breath in lengthening the arms forward, drawing the hips into the heels and tenting your fingers. And then exhale your arms to the right. Take a deep breath into your left side. And exhale. Inhale back to center, reach your arms forward, lifting them off of your mat, inhale. Exhale, walk your hands to the left and release your forehead onto your mat, drawing the right shoulder down into the mat. Inhale. Exhale. Good. Inhale, walk your hands up into center, drawing yourself up into a tabletop and just start swaying your hips side to side here drawing attention to the quality of your breath. Deep inhale and a long exhalation out the mouth. Good. Inhale, look up into a cow, tailbone up, drop the belly button down, press the mat away from you. Exhale, round your back, look down past your legs, draw the belly button into the spine. Again, inhale, look up, wrist beneath the shoulders, press the mat away, reach the heart forward. Exhale, round. Do that again. And again, round out as you exhale. Good, inhale back to a neutral spine. Walk our hands slightly forward, tuck the toes and send your hips back for downward facing dog as you exhale. Start pedaling the feet here, bringing the heels up and lowering one heel down as you exhale. Press the mat away from you here, opening your fingers wide and reaching the tailbone up and away from you. Drawing the belly button in, relax the neck Gaze right past your legs, right in between your legs. Beautiful downward facing dog. Inhale both heels up. 
right on the ball of your feet and lift the tailbone up and away from you. Really reach it up high, press the mat away from you, drawing the elbows in towards each other to frame your upper back. Exhale, heels down towards your mat, maybe straightening the back of your legs and pressing them towards the back of the room here. Inhale, heels up, walk the ball of the feet to the front of the mat. Inhale into a half lift. In your half lift, your hands are either on your mat, on your shins, or on the upper thighs. And then exhale, fold forward. Bend the knees, hold opposite elbows, and just sway yourself gently side to side here. <sighs> Connecting with your breath, allowing your mind to just drop into your body. Notice the sensations that you feel in your sides and your hips. Relaxing the neck here. Release the spine down. Come back to center. Hands on your mat, inhale, half lift, sending your weight into the ball of the feet, reaching the crown forward, trying to get into a flat back by reaching the tailbone up and away from you. Draw the belly button in, exhale, fold forward. Inhale, bend the knees, bring yourself all the way up, reaching the arms overhead. Inhale, press the palms together. Release the fingers and send the index back for a small back bend. <sighs> Enough so that you can still breathe. Press the tailbone forward, pubic bone forward, and then exhale, fold forward. <sighs> Inhale, half lift. Exhale, bend the knees, plant the hands, step back into high plank, lower the knees down, lower all the way down to the mat. Untuck the toes, lengthening the legs. Inhale, baby cobra, squeeze the shoulder blades together, elbows by your side, look down at your mat. Exhale, lower. Do this again, hands underneath shoulders. Inhale, squeeze the shoulder blades, lift up. Exhale, lower. One more time, pressing the top of the feet into the mat, lifting the kneecaps. Inhale. Gently lower as you exhale. Hands underneath shoulders, press yourself up into a tabletop. Exhale, downward facing dog. Inhale, heels up, bend the knees, hop or step to the front of the mat. Inhale, half lift. Exhale, fold. Inhale all the way up, reaching up high, and come into a nice back bend. Breathe. Inhale, back up. Exhale, fold forward. Good, inhale, half lift. Exhale, plant the hands, step the right leg back, lower the back knee, untuck the toes, inhale, hands overhead, exhale, low lunge. Square the hips to the front of the mat, front knee in line with your ankle. Inhale, reach up high, but slide the shoulder blades down your back, draw the belly button into the spine. Inhale, reach up, exhale, cactus arms opening the chest again reach up high one more cactus inhale reach high exhale plant the right hand inside of the left foot twist to the left reaching the left arm high up above you inhale exhale good plant that Left hand inside of the left foot, heel toe your foot out towards the side of the mat and just drop that left foot onto its outer edge. Inhale, reach the heart forward. Exhale. One more. And exhale. Option to bend that back knee and grab that 
foot with your left hand. Inhale, reach up. Heart shining forward. Exhale, press that right quad down deeper into your mat. Inhale. And exhale, release that down. Heel toe your left foot back to center. Exhale, send your hips back for half splits, flexing the left toes forward. Inhale, lengthen the spine, coming out of your fold slightly. Exhale, fold deeper. Keeping in mind that lengthening of the spine. Deep breath in the back of the left leg, inhale. And exhale. Good. Inhale, walk the hands forward, bend the knee, step back into high plank, lower down halfway into chaturanga. Inhale, up dog. Exhale, downward facing dog. Good. Inhale, heels up, walk the feet to the front of the mat. Inhale, half lift. Gently exhale, fold. Maybe bring your belly closer to your thighs, drawing the belly button in to your spine. Inhale, lift. Exhale, bend the knees, plant the hands, step the left leg back, lower the back knee. Inhale, arms overhead. Exhale, bend the front knee to lunge. Inhale, reach high, square the hips to the front of the mat. Exhale, bend that front knee deeper. When I say square the hips, send that left hip forward and the right hip back into its socket. Strengthen the abdominals by drawing in the belly button and sending the tailbone down towards the mat. Inhale, reach out of the top hands. Exhale, cactus your arms. Again, reach up, reach, reach, reach. Feel that nice left side stretching all the way into the left hip flexor. Exhale, cactus your arms. Squeeze the shoulder blades, shining your sternum up. Inhale, reach up one last time. Exhale, plant that left hand down inside of the right foot and turn into your side twist to the right, drawing that right arm overhead. Reach out of the top hand as if somebody's pulling you up from the sky. Reach, exhale, again. And exhale. Plant that right hand inside of the right foot. Heel toe your right foot onto the edge of the mat. Send it onto its outer edge and drop the knee out towards the side. Inhale, lengthen the spine forward, shine in your heart. And exhale. Stay here. Release. Option to bend that back knee, grabbing that left foot with the right hand. Inhale and exhale, press that left hip down closer to the mat. Again, breathe. Breathe into that left hip, that lift, left hip flexor quad. I know it might feel tense, but try and release that tension there. Good, release that knee, bring that hand back down, heel toe your right foot towards the center. Maybe walk it forward slightly and then exhale, send your hips back for half splits here. Flex the right toes towards you, inhale. Come out of your fold, lengthen your spine forward, including the crown of your head. And then exhale, fold, leading with the heart. Breathe into the back of that right hamstring. One more breath here. Good, walk your hands forward, bend that front knee, tuck the back toes, lift the back knee, 
come into a high lunge. Inhale, arms overhead, reach up. Palms together, exhale, point the index back for a beautiful back bend. Press out of that back heel, strong legs. Exhale, bend that front knee deeper. And then exhale, bring the hands onto your mat. Walk your hands to the side of your mat, turning both feet onto the sides. So the front and back edge of your mat is in line with the outer edges of your feet. Hands underneath shoulders, inhale into a half lift in your wide-legged forward fold. Press the tailbone up and away from you. Send your weight into the ball of your feet. And then exhale, fold forward, leading with the heart. Option to walk your hands far behind you. Send your weight forward or holding the outer edges of your shins. Inhale, lift the tailbone up, bend the elbows. Exhale, bring your forehead, your, the crown of your head onto your mat. Inhale. And exhale. Breathe into the inner thighs here. You might feel it into the outer edges of your shins all the way to your ankles. Good. Inhale, walk the hands beneath the shoulders, half lift. And then turn your feet towards the back of the mat. Come into your high lunge on the other side. Inhale, reach your arms overhead. Come out slightly, exhale, bend the front knee to lunge deeper. Press out of that back heel, lifting the kneecap. One more breath, drawing the shoulder blades down your back. Scissor the hips. Inhale, look up, palms together, interlace the fingers, press the index back for a nice back bend. Deep inhale. Exhale, bend that front knee deeper. Strong glutes. Inhale, exhale, and exhale, plant your hands onto your mat, step back into high plank, we'll hold our high plank here for a count of five, four, draw the belly button in, three, two, one, bring the knees down onto the mat, Good, and then turn, turn the left leg onto its outer side, and then bring yourself onto a modified side plank, pressing the outer edge of your right foot down onto your mat, sending the right arm overhead, palm facing down. Shine your heart to the side, inhale, lift that right leg off of the mat, and breathe. option to grab that right foot with the right hand, press the foot into the hand, opening that front line of the body. One more breath. Slowly release the leg parallel to the mat and then bring the right hand down and let's come on to the other side. Shift that right leg directly sideways. Bring that right hand below your shoulder, come onto your side. Inhale, draw that left arm overhead, palm facing down, opening the chest and the shoulder towards the side of the room. Inhale, lift that left leg off of the mat, parallel to the mat. Flex that foot, strengthening the glute, the left glute. Inhale. And exhale, bend that left knee, grab that ankle with your left foot, and then press the foot into the hand and press the front of the hip towards the side of your room. Deep breath. Good. Release that leg back parallel to the mat, sending your arm overhead. And then exhale, turn towards your mat, bring that left hand down, bringing both knees down onto the mat. 
Open your knees mat with the part, big toes to touch. Send your hips back into your heels. Arms forward, forehead on your mat for a wide-legged child's pose. Deep inhale. And a nice exhale. Again. Good. One final pose. We'll come onto our sit bones. And we'll lower ourselves slowly onto our backs, drawing our knees into our chest, swaying ourselves side to side here. <sighs> Good. And then we'll plant both feet onto our mats. We'll draw that left ankle upwards towards the sky and draw it onto our right thigh for thread the needle. Inhale, exhale, draw that right knee into the chest, interlacing the fingers around the right thigh, keeping that left foot flex towards your left knee. Inhale, relax the shoulders into the mat. Exhale, draw the knee in deeper into your chest. Inhale, press the tailbone down into your mat. Exhale, draw the knee in. Inhale, relax the throat and the jaw. Exhale, draw the knee in deeper. Plant the right foot down on your mat. Release the left foot on your mat. Inhale, the right leg above you. Bring the right ankle onto your left thigh. Inhale. Exhale, interlace the fingers behind the thigh or the shin and draw the knee in. Inhale, relax the shoulder blades. Exhale, draw the knee in deeper. You can try pressing the thigh, the right thigh away with your right elbow, if that's accessible to you. Again. Draw the knee in deeper. Deep breath into the right hip. Exhale, relax the tailbone and the back. One more breath. Good. Bring both feet down on the mat. Mat at least hip width apart and just sway your knees side to side. Oh yeah, that feels good. Just allowing them to flop side by side with your breath. And then we'll finally come into our happy baby. So grab either the shins or the outer edges of the feet and draw the knees and the, and the thighs down towards your mat, arms inside of the thighs. So I'll set myself up so that you can see this more clearly here. So again, my feet are flexed in line with the knees, and this is an active pose. So try drawing the tailbone down towards your mat as you draw the thighs closer towards your mat, relaxing the back onto your mat. Relax the shoulders. Deep breath here. And you can open one leg at a time, still holding on to your foot or your shin. You can play around with your happy baby here. Opening the back of the thighs. And even opening both legs. Remembering 
trying to press the tailbone down into your mat. And then when you're done, releasing the feet down on your mat and extending your legs out in your final Shavasana. Allow yourself to fully take on all the space that you desire, opening your arms out, pressing the shoulders down into the mat as they relax. Releasing your hands, your fingers, your wrists, your ankles, your toes, your legs, your pelvis, your belly, your breath. Inhale into the belly, all the way up the chest. Open your mouth and sigh it out. Allow yourself to rest in your own stillness, in your sacred space, thanking yourself for taking the time dedicating yourself to your practice and self-love. Spend as much time as you need on your mat, diving deep to the sense of ease, relaxing your thoughts, your body, And your spirit allowing, allowing yourself to completely open up to that sense of relaxation. Mahalo Nuiloa for joining me in your practice. Namaste.